I thought you just wanted to talk. Well, why are you arresting me? Did you see what that nut job did? How the hell did he do that anyway? I don't care about him. I want to know about the murder of Strider Novak. Strider? Oh, man. I was trying not to think about that. Just focus on the I know he now. was going to replace you and force you into an early retirement so you can knock it off with the weepy act. I didn't kill him if that's what you're thinking. I would never do that. All right. We can do this one of three ways. Well, let me guess. The easy way or... Oh, what the hell? There is no easy way. We can do this the fast way, the slow way, then... <laughs> There's my favorite way. Mm -hmm. So try me, because there is nothing I love more than making a grown man cry. I'll, I'll tell you everything you want to know. So that's your favorite way. Hey, I've always wondered since I saw you give that speech in Weaponizer 3, Thou Shalt Not Kill. I thought that sounded familiar. Wait, wait a minute. Are you Chloe Decker? She is. Amazing, isn't it? What the hell is going on around here? He was about to talk. Well, apologies for the interruption, but if you allow me to make amends, I've got a few skills of my own. Tell me. Rex, what is it you desire? I... I... want a good story. What, what are you talking about? Uh, people, they don't follow cars anymore. They follow drivers, drama. Strider's dad, he was a NASCAR legend. And your biggest rival, if I remember correctly. When he died, so did my merch sales. So getting Strider to replace him, that, 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 that got the rivalry back. Okay, but how does that help you? You were out of a job. I started a management firm about a year ago. Strider was a client. It was my idea to get him to replace me. Poor kid. Strider, you, you're so happy when I made him that offer. Well, yeah, it was an opportunity of a lifetime. Apparently, he needed the money to get him out of a jam. What do you mean, jam? He was having some trouble with a, a guy at work. Uh, uh, excuse me. What the hell was that back there? I've already apologized for interrupting your monologue, Miss Decker. No, how the hell did you get Rex to spill like that? Ah, well, I have the ability to draw out people's desires. Well, what are you, psychic or something? No, no, I can't read people's minds. I'm not a Jedi. <laughs> People just like to tell me things. Okay, well, we should stop stepping on each other's toes because we both clearly want the same thing. Oh, very forward of you, Miss Decker. Yes, I will have sex with you. We should probably solve this murder first. No, oh. no, I mean that we should work together. <laughs> no. I mean, you've proven a very impressive adversary, but I'm not really a work-together kind of devil, so... Well, too bad. Because I know who Strider was fighting with at work. Very well. Lead the way, Mr. Cuff. <laughs>